Hi guys, I am getting tired myself of the gaps that I've left between my videos, but it's really circumstantial. For those of you who have followed me on Instagram, <laughs> little shameless plug, go follow me on Instagram. You know that we are currently living at a hotel, which sounds a lot more luxurious than it actually is, trust me. Uh, but I'm also not being like, oh my god, boohoo, we're living at a hotel, life sucks. Not at all. Um, I know what it means to not have a home, to not have running water at home. I'm not saying that as a disclaimer, but it's just how it is. But we've had unluck in the sense that we had to leave our house um, whilst this is still not ready. We were hoping that this would be ready by the time we sell our old house and the new people had to move in. But it wasn't uh, due to human beings. <laughs> We've had some unluck. But here is just a little house update for you as an in-betweeny because real soon, in a matter of a few weeks, we will be living here, believe it or not. <laughs> it won't be entirely ready, but the upstairs will be ready. Um, so without further ado, let me show you how it looks like now. This is where we enter the house via these doors behind me. This is the hallway. It will be like completely different, uh, hopefully real soon. There'll be a huge round mirror over there. All that jazz. Built-ins over here. This is the toilet, uh, the guest bathroom. This is an office space um, for my boyfriend. It's going to be a little man cave with a snooker table. You can see that the garden is already shaping up real nicely. So this is already also giving me a lot of positive vibes. This is the future office of the boyfriend. And then we go into the living room. This is how it looks like now. Not, not, not very fancy, but next year we hope to put a huge Christmas tree over there. And then over here is our kitchen, our kitchen space. There's a built-in fireplace. The built-ins are gonna go in there, like, you know, the whole thing. There'll be an L-shaped island over there with bar stools around it and it will have a view of the garden again it might not look like much to you but i can see it all coming together so yeah i cannot wait i cannot wait for spring we'll have a big round table outside and oh i just cannot wait the pool house over there, will, which will be basically like a guest house, but also like a lovely place to spend time in the summer. The swimming pool, which is getting naturally filled by rain right now. Um, yeah, and this is the living room with a high ceiling. The dining room will be over there. The TV nook will be there. And then behind that wall over there is a guest room, which will be always ready to accommodate whoever wants to come here. There's a window here to get some natural daylight. And yeah, it'll be really nice. I hope at least. So that is that. And then let's head upstairs. So now we're upstairs. This is where I currently do the laundry. It's just the way it is. This will be the laundry room as well. I wanted to have one where I can look into the garden and feel like part of the house whenever I'm, you know, 
doing the laundry and ironing. And then when we move over here, we have our bedroom, which is almost as good as entirely ready, except for the ceiling that needs to be placed and then the built-ins that need to need to be finished up. But this is just, this is like really giving me so much positive vibes. There's this beautiful matte wood over here, um, drawers over here, and then these ones are pushed to open. I wanted to have a little bit of a hotel vibe in here, but um, I kind of forgot how high the ceilings are. And then this is all for the boyfriend, just a beautiful built-in. It's, like I said, not entirely ready yet, but as good as. I'm just so excited. Well, let me take my coffee. So this is where the, the bed will go. We'll have a beautiful green view of everything once, you know, everything will be green in spring and the fireplace. And then the space that might interest you the most, or at least it interests me the most, is my closet. Look at this. It's coming together real nice. So this is basically my office. It's where I'm planning to film a lot of videos. Hold on, let me, oh, let me get this look. Sorry if it's grainy, it is what it is, but that way you get an overview of everything. And yeah, I just absolutely love it. This is where I'll be displaying my beautiful handbags, but I also have the option to close the doors if I just don't want any mess or when I'm actually like working on a computer. And I'll have a table which I can move around as I wish. Then I have a shoe closet over there which will not be entirely filled because I, I, I don't, my, my goal is to not entirely fill the space up because I had just have space. I just want to have enough space so that it looks really nice also on camera. But my goal is to not have to fill up absolutely everything. But I already cannot wait to keep my, I don't know, my small other goods over here and my accessories, all that stuff. And obviously my clothes. So this is how it'll be. And then let's move over here. This is our bathroom. It is shaping up pretty nice. Um, you see that most of the furniture is already fitted. Actually, it is entirely fitted. That's what I forgot about. There will be, there's this little space over here so that if I want to, I can put a little ottoman or something here so that I can sit down and just do my makeup or whatever it is that I want to do. I'm still debating on what kind of mirrors and how I'm going to install it here because it's a huge surface. I mean, I don't even know how to how to show it how high the ceilings actually are, but this is pretty much how it's going to look like. And then I have an entire cupboard here for my products which I'm really excited. I cannot wait to just transfer everything from the hotel back here. So we each have a drawer over here, which is essential in a bathroom. And then this will be used as a hamper to just to throw all of the dirty laundry inside so that hopefully there won't be much of a mess around here. And this is where the walk-in shower is going to go and a bath over here. 
So yeah, shaping up real nice. And then a space to alleviate us whenever we need to go and do our more private business. So yeah, this is how it looks like at this moment. A little update for you guys. Like I said, this is how it looks like now, but um, I'll update you because there will be a lot of new things happening around the coming weeks. I will keep you posted because I know a lot of you are just as excited about it as I am, which just, it really like moves me to no end that you guys are really excited for me as well. It's been a long time coming and I cannot wait to actually live here. But it's already super warm in here, so whew, I'm enjoying it. I could like hang around here, but there's no toilet for the moment. So I need to go to pee, so I have to go back to the hotel ASAP. Um, but this was it, a little update for you guys. If I'm not around uh, regularly the upcoming weeks, you know why I'm busy with, you know, trying to finish up everything over here, but um, regular content is going to follow. I do have that room there, which is specially designed so that I can give you guys the best content that I can possibly give, but just also have fun. Have fun on YouTube because this was always my my goal to just have fun, entertain you, and enjoy it myself. That's all. Bye, guys.